Have you seen his Vegas hidey hole? That's pretty luxe. I'm looking at a yeah. giant kidney shape. It's got to be an Olympic sized pool. Um, it's only three stories tall. It's kind of an intimate setting. There's a pool house. There's a huge hot tub. And when he says he just went out for a pleasure trip, he knows, quote, some people, what people? Sex workers? Yeah. He, well, you know, that's where the question is. And Nancy, as I'm thinking about it, and I'm thinking about the picture of his luxury condo in Vegas in my head right now, and you contrast that to the home we see in Massive People Park. I was there. Mm. So I've seen it with my own eyes. The difference, right? So maybe when we talk about a double life, I mean, this really may have been one. The property in Massapequa Park, I'm sure people have seen pictures, it is dilapidated. It's the one house on that street and that whole neighborhood that if you walk down the street, you would say someone strange lives at that house. Do you know what I mean? Every other house is viewed meticulous landscaping. That house is falling apart. And then you look at this luxury Las Vegas condo. And so you start to question or wonder, maybe this really was a, some sort of double life. 